this is the energy vibration reading for um for the um hurt signs um for the Taurus for very Capricorn this is the February uh, full moon reading I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for returning please like share these videos if this is your first time please leave a message and subscribe I want to say to each and every person the full moon the blood moon is going to be on the 19th of February so please be aware of this thank you for the wonderful um, energies energies positive energy vibration that is coming up thank you so much thank you for the likes and shares okay remember the sun sign people are born between the hours of um, 5 a.m. and um, 7 p.m. in the evening okay we are here with the central of the Leo so whatever is happening here the Leo's or you, some of you could be taking on the sign of the Leo's the inner strength Capricorns you're central in this reading so a lot of Capricorns is going to be helping the rest of the sign the Taurus and Virgos a lot of Capricorns are going to be helping so as we look first we're going to be looking at uh, and this could be this full moon could be uh, affecting a lot of the Capricorn so be aware of this okay for the Sun sign people we we are dealing with mercury mercury seems to be coming up in this full moon um, it is the energy vibration of the Sun this full moon so mercury is coming up some of you uh, Mars is here which is work so mercury and Mars is here which is work some of you are dealing with the scorpions okay so whatever the situation is some of you are definitely dealing with the scorpions scorpions came up for the air sign people so if you have someone that is an air sign or so you can go and watch the air sign the Aquarius Gemini and Libra reading that is there now definitely the scorpion and mercury is definitely coming up in this quarter so a lot of you it's all about you learning to manifest and um, becoming um, your own business becoming uh, it's all about careers and finding your divine purpose in this quarter for most of you um, earth sign people so for you fire sign people and you are the people who are born 5 p 5 a.m. until um, 7 p.m. you're going to be dealing with a, a finding out um, something that you can do that you weren't aware of and this is going to make you make a lot of money scorpions or here some of you could be dealing with the scorpions these could be in relationship forms we're going to be looking at that for the moon people the people who were born after 7 p.m. until 5 a.m. in the morning you are dealing with the Pisces a lot of water energy and the Tauruses so you um, Tauruses um, you Tauruses could be connecting with the Sun sign Capricorn and that is a good relationship so you can you Tauruses could be connecting with the Sun sign Capricorn that is going to make a fabulous relationship what I so love about um, this month for you earth sign people which is so beautiful is that the Pisces and the cancer and the scorpions are here now a lot of you Capricorn could be in a relationship with the cancers and the scorpions you could be going in relationships with the cancer or the scorpions and I'm taking on the energy of uh, the Leo so there are situations that are here that are happening which is very positive very good because it's moving you and aligning you and remember that the, the Capricorns are the most spiritual people some of you Capricorns also could be dealing with the Pisces um, in the, this so you know the Virgos are not showing up but what is happening is definitely that uh, you are sign people especially the Capricorn and the Tauruses are going to be aligning the Virgos the Virgos are going to be connecting in relationship with the Pisces and the cancers because this is what a lot of people don't know and this is I need to do a relationship is that um, earth sign people are most compatible with other earth sign people or with the water sign people the Pisces um, cancer and scorpion and this is why some of you are having bad relationships is because um, you're not aware of that that um, it's better to connect with your own art sign now 
as I'm looking at this I'm seeing that the Capricorns and the Taurus especially the Capricorn Sun and Moon and it can be both because the Capricorns is in the center what is transpiring and what is happening is that you guys are just going to be so connected um, and the Virgos you know it, it's as if this is going to be like um, realizing who your partners who your mates are okay so let's look and see <coughs> what is mercury bringing in for the the fire okay insecurity a lot of you are going to be insecure insecure about your work insecure about love insecure about who you are this is going to be coming up a lot of insecurity um, it's going to be uh, facing resurfacing for you earth sign people especially you fire sign so <coughs> the people who <coughs> were born 5 a.m. in the morning the 5 p.m. <coughs> sorry I'm seeing this a lot of insecurity is going to be coming up by you guys really unbelievable a lot of insecurities now let's see what coming up for Mars oh, yeah victimized some of you are going to be feel felt victimized okay um, in your career okay you're gonna be felt victimized in your career whatever the situation is some of you are definitely going to be felt the victimized in your career okay so some of you um, could be realizing that <clears throat> I miss my career <coughs> I want to go back to my career whatever as transpiring that's definitely what is going to be happening and yeah guys I had um, I need to rest my throat and this is what what's happening to me scorpions what what is going to be happening with you and the scorpions you're gonna be releasing the scorpions whoever uh, you are um, and you are in a relationship with a scorpion or this could be your son or a family member or a friend you're going to be having some real insecurity with a scorpion and you're going to be releasing them and a scorpion could be also showing you insecurity about yourself and 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 um, you're going to be realizing that a scorpion if you're working with this person they're your boss that you're going to be feeling victimized by them okay you're really going to be feeling victimized by them and this is going to be um, something that you're going to think I need to let go of this and let it go now let's see what is coming out for the Pisces fate the Pisces are going to be coming in and giving a lot of you guys renewal of faith because the Pisces are very psychic so they're definitely going to be coming in and give you guys a renewal of faith which is very very good okay so whatever the situation that is happening the Pisces are going to be returning your faith to you okay whatever the transition is the Pisces are definitely going to be returning your faith to you what is this the Taurus going to be doing for you guys the Taurus are going to be renewal so some of you if you were in a relationship with a Taurus the Taurus could be returning in your life okay definitely the Taurus is going to be returning in your life some of you could be going in business with the Taurus so if you had a past um, connection with the Taurus he could be coming back and reuniting with you okay so if you you grew up and you know this person or you know this person from the past he is definitely coming back and asking for a new start so I would say go for it because um the Taurus and uh, the Tauruses and the Capricorns and the Virgo is very very positive relationship what is here for the cancers how the cancers grief so some of you could be in a relationship with the cancers there is going to be some grief um, grief in the sense that you could be finding out that this cancer um, is in grief or this cancer um, misses you or this cancer cheated on you but whatever the situation is they're going to be bringing some grief in your life or they themselves are in grief so um, what is here is really 
um, it's all about working on yourselves you guys it's really about working on yourself if you uh, see what is transpiring it is really about working on yourself because as you work on yourself what is transpiring and what is going to be happening is that um, you have to heal your heart chakras to release the insecurity some of you if you were born 5 a.m. until 7 p.m. some of you are having insecurity and feeling victimized you need to let this go okay you really really need to get this go whatever is happening you need to release yourself of this insecurity why are you insecure whatever someone has done you to make this insecurity look at the person is that person perfect no they're not okay um, what have that person done to you they have invaded your your tinder so release it release it really look at yourself and look at what that person has done and then you can um, see um, what it is that you need to release okay now for you moon people the people who were born between the hours of 7 p.m. and 5 a.m. what is going to be happening is that the Pisces are coming in to bring back fate and the Taurus is going to bring some renewal to you but whatever the grief is um, with the cancer let it go because you don't need um, that sort of a situation now completion let's see here so some of you um, Capricorn could be um, working um, and helping um, your 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 sisters or brother sign um, to deal with this grief okay and um, some of you self some of you self could be dealing with this grief so whatever is here whatever is transpiring um, definitely um, you guys are dealing with some insecurity and grief but it's going to come to an end by this full moon period okay because you're going to be understanding what makes you so secure insecure money nine of Pentacles is going to be coming in so you shouldn't be secure um, new love someone who um, you were dealing with um, um, have uh, um, make you feel victimized release um, you need to release the conflicts between you and the pi, uh, a scorpion. If you guys are having a, a, a conflict with you and a, a scorpion, this person can be a child from zero to forty-five. Let it go. 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 Okay, the Pisces. What's happening? The Pisces are going to be returning your fate. The Seven of Cups. The Pisces are going to be helping you to open up doors of opportunity. What are the Tauruses? Um, in this full moon here for they're going to be helping you to celebrate to bring back life to, to return you um, after all of what you need to release okay grief with the cancer what is the energy with this grief with the cancer um, the cancer is having grief about their foundation okay so um, the cancers are definitely having grief about their foundations now um, some of um, you could be receiving a message to 10 could be receiving a message about a completion okay so whatever the situation is that was transpiring it could that it affect your life your kids life a situation between you and your partner a situation between you and a friend a situation between you and a lover whatever is transpiring is that there's a completion there's a completion you're going to be releasing the grief you're going to be releasing the victim the victimization would um, <clears throat> whoever had a relationship with a cancer and you have to divorce or you're separating um, you're going to be letting go that grief and said you know if I'm supposed to have the house or he's supposed to have the house you know the universe um, you know let me know what to do and whatever is happening there's a renewal and the and the Tauruses are going to be helping you guys um to bring back renewal in your world they're going to let you party like you're crazy um you know they're going to be connecting with you in such a positive manner and I love when the Pisces comes in in a heart sign reading because the Pisces are so powerful they're really their fate and um because they're so psychic um, you guys always connect with the Pisces and 
what they're going to be bringing in your world is a lot of opportunities and this is going to be good a lot of opportunities I love this reading I want to say um, to each and every person thank you um, for being here please like share these videos it is very important to like and share these videos um, leave a message to let me know what you feel what, what you found um, about this reading and I want to say to each and every person whatever the insecurity is whatever that is transpiring do not take on other people energies um, if other people may let you be insecure it's not your problem it's their problem you are just carrying their energies you need to let it go and understand that life is full of surprises I want to say to the youtubers um, goodbye this reading is um, 50 minute long if you would like to connect with us on on demand we are here um, it's just a dollar 99 and you have the video for yourself you download the video and you have the video for